Hi friends, today I am going to discuss about QPSK that is quadrature phase shift keying. QPSK is a form of phase modulation technique in which two information bits combined as one symbol are modulated at once selecting one of the four possible carrier phase shift states. We have 360 degree of phase to work with and four phase states and thus the separation should be 360 by 4 that is 90 degree. So our four QPSK phase shifts are 45 degree, 135 degree, 225 degree and 315 degree. Note that the phase shift to digital data correspondence shown above is a logical though arbitrary choice as long as the transmitter and receiver agree to interpret phase shift in the same way. Different correspondence schemes can be used. The above set explanation can be visualized here. So if 0, 0 is there then we can say it is 45 degree phase shift 0 1 135 1 0 225 1 1 the bits 1 1 is represented by 315 degree phase shift the same can be interpreted in this table as well where the in phase component and quadrature phase component phases are considered non-inverted in phase and non-inverted quadrature phase components are there then phase shift will be 45 similarly for the second one where inverted in phase component and quadrature phase non-inverted 135 will be the phase shift then both in phase and quadrature are inverted 225 degree will be the phase shift in phase is non-inverted and the quadrature phase is inverted then the phase shift will be 315 degree okay the same table we can verify in our QPSK model as well so as I have represented here the QPSK model you can see it is having Bernoulli binary generator and again Bernoulli's binary generator sine wave and sine wave this is because in actual QPSK what we are going to do is the bit stream is divided as even and odd odd bit streams the data sequence that is the basic message sequence is divided as even and odd bit streams then it is BPSK modulated so instead of taking a single bit stream and dividing into two even and odd bit streams, I have taken two separate bit streams and modulated using this switch. And <coughs> this is the first carrier sine wave with zero phase shift. So this we can call as in phase component or in phase carrier this is quadrature phase carrier because there is a phase phase shift of 90 degree okay this product product modulator along with the switch acts as a BPSK modulator this is in phase modulator and this is quadrature phase modulator when we add both we will get QPSK waveform or the QPSK modulated signal so let us see the waveforms now so here we can see different phases of this QPSK wave this is our bitstream one this is another bitstream you can consider this as even bitstream this is odd it is like 0 0 0 1 1 1 1 0 
okay then this is in phase carrier this is quadrature phase carrier and this one is our qps wave here we can visualize different types of phase shifts this is one this is another this is the next and this is the fourth one which is similar to these phase shifts you can see over here correct so this circuitry will generate a qpsk wave and let me be clear with the block parameters first one bernoulli's binary generator with probability 0.5 initial seed 40 and the second bernoulli's generator is having 0.5 of probability and initial seed is 48 we are keeping different initial seed because we want to have different set of waveforms if i keep here also 40 both the waveforms will be same so we'll get only 00, 0 or 11 1 as combinations but we want all the four combinations as 00, 0 0 1 1 0 and 1 1 so we have to vary the initial seed value and as i have shown already this is sine wave in phase carrier this is quadrature phase carrier this switch and this switch along with the product modulator they act as a <coughs> modulators and this is our final adder which adds in phase and quadrature phase component to give QPSK now coming to the receiver end we have two BPSK demodulators one is in phase demodulator another one is quadrature phase demodulator in phase demodulator has a sine wave carrier signal with same frequency and phase as that of the one which we have seen at the input end or the modulator end and quadrature phase demodulator has another sine wave block with 90 degree phase shift So this demodulator is a coherent detector with two different demodulators that is BPSK demodulator with in phase, BPSK demodulator with quadrature phase. After demodulation we can visualize the waveform now, you can see here this is our QPSK wave which is given to BPSK in phase and quadrature phase modulator and these are the output this is data out 1 this is data out 2 and this is data in that is taken from the transmitter end this is data in 2 so we can see here this data in 1 and data out 1 are same data in 2 and data out 2 are same but they are delayed by one bit you can see here this signal is starting from here but actually it has started from one at this point it has been started from 1.5 correct similarly here this one it is somewhat delayed version of the original input I hope you have understood about QPSK in MATLAB Simulink.